the Sheep Who Wouldn't Sleep, written by Susan Rich Broke, illustrated by Dean Gray. The moon rose up high on a grassy green hill. The silver stars shimmered and all was still. The fluffy lamb snuggled up all in a heap except for one sheep who just wouldn't sleep. I'm not tired. The sheep wasn't ready to finish her day. She didn't feel tired. She wanted to play. How could her friends all just lie around snoring? Bah, thought the sheep. Sleeping is boring. She wanted to run and to skip and to leap. The last thing she wanted to do was sleep. Hush, said the rabbit. Will you please quiet down? It's hard to get rest with you leaping around. If you're having trouble with falling asleep, just do what I do and try counting sheep. Counting her friends kind of sounded like fun. Thanks, said the sheep, and she started with one. But the sheep in her mind ran a ziggy zag line, so she kept losing track. Was that eight or nine? Thinking and counting soon made the sheep dozy. She flopped on the ground, but she couldn't get cozy. Not cozy, still not cozy, meh. Your wool, said a hedgehog, is soft as can be. Be thankful you don't have the prickles like me. The hedgehog was fun, he made the sheep giggle which made her legs jiggle, which made her tail wiggle. And after some jiggling and wiggling about, she found that she had wiggled her sillies right out. The sheep closed her eyes. Was something beside her? She popped her eyes open and shrieked, Eek, a spider! Shh, said the spider, it's my bedtime too. Don't think about me and I won't bother you. The sheep breathed in deeply, then slowly breathed out. Every thought, every fear, every worry and doubt. Spider, spiderweb, thunder, storm, lightning, the dark, shadows, haircuts, missing out, bugs, monsters. Now her body was rested, her mind was all clear. But what were those noises she started to hear? Ribbit, beep, beep, croak. Shh, 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 said the cricket. It helps if you try to imagine the sound as a sweet lullaby. The little sheep listened and closed her eyes. And when she did, to her surprise, the hoots and the chirps and the peeps were a song. The music was soothing, and before very long, the moonlit grew dim on the grassy green hill. The silver stars twinkled and all was still. As the wispy white clouds drifted dreamily past, the sheep who wouldn't sleep slept at last. <laughs>